Hey YouTube, how you guys doing today? Kevin here coming at you with a bonus video. So this video right here is about the KE-102 frame. Uh, yes, I'm painting it on the back of my truck. Don't care about the paint because this tailgate is junk. So um, it has already been painted before this color green. So I did the um, final touch-ups on it. And I am actually just clear coating it now with some Rust-Oleum Universal Clear Top Coat. This stuff works pretty well. Gives it a nice high gloss shine. So I got a lot of questions about the paint that I'm using on the bike. And I'll show you what it is. So I figured I'd throw this out there. And uh, I thought it looked pretty cool. So I'll show you guys. It came out really, really nice. Very happy with the finish. This is uh, Color Right Off-Road Paint. Kawasaki Lime Green. There is the number right there. The 3050 OR. Okay, so make sure you do the OR. That on the bottom there too. Um, they're about 20 bucks a can. It took me to do the frame. It took me four cans. So it's like 80 bucks. 80 bucks worth of paint. And then I got this at uh, the hardware store at Lowe's. So and this here was like eight bucks, a, uh, eight bucks a can. Two cans. It's fast drying. So I figured I'd give you guys a first look at the uh, the frame how it's coming out. And then uh, this week we're gonna start putting this thing together so we got a lace in the wiring all that stuff we're going to start first step after we get this part painted is to get the triple tree up top down bottom get that on there so we can start laying in the headlight assembly where the handlebars go all that type of stuff and then work our way back for all the wiring got to do the battery box we have to paint everything nothing else is painted other than the frame so it's going to be piece by piece Little by little, we still got to do the swing arm. We got to do the shocks. I got to order the shocks. I haven't ordered them yet. Um, we're going to be lacing rims. We're going to be doing a lot of cool stuff with this bike from a ground up, um, you know, but not really a restoration, but a build. It's an actual build. So, and, and the KE 102 engine that we have yet to fire up has not been ran yet. It's going to go on this. That really cool um, expansion chamber that I picked up is also going to go on this bike. We've got a lot of cool things. This bike is going to have the tachometer. You guys remember all that. So we're going to do a parts layout um, this weekend. I'll do a special video and show you guys what that's all about. But I thought it was pretty cool and I wanted to show it to you guys. So tell me what you guys think. Sorry it's a short video. Not really doing much of anything. Just clear coating and uh, getting her all done. But you guys get to see how it looks. I got the uh, threads taped off in the back. That's where the bolts go for the shocks. But I thought it looked pretty cool. We have to put the lock back in there. We're going to be doing all kinds of stuff to this. So. This is the 2000 or 1999-2000 uh, bike I picked up in Vermont. So this is the one. There's a first look on this one uh, early on. I always do my first look. It's got the red barn in the background there. So this is the one I picked up in uh, in Vermont. So it's pretty cool. So got it down here. Got all the paperwork squared away on it. Uh, because this is going to be a street machine. And it's going to be a nice one at that. So I figured I'd do a first look, like I said. So hopefully you guys enjoy the videos. And uh, I'm going to put that up on the screen one more time. This is the Kawasaki Green by Colorite Off-Road Paint. Matches original factory color. Requires no clear coat, but I am clear coating it anyway. And the reason why I'm clear coating it, because if you spill fuel on it, it won't break up the paint. And it's a little bit, the clear coat's a little bit stronger than this one. And then right there, 3050 OR. Kawasaki Lime Green. That's it. That's all there is to it. Anyway, guys, I'm out. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And I will talk to you guys later. I'm out.